Hi guys, welcome to this uh, ISO Builder again. We have a topic that we should discuss and is the Adplinx 3 tool. If you update your system and control Alt E, this happens and he wants to know your root password and we give it to him and we got this nice new uh, image now, backend for Adplinx 3 tool. The terminal fun is back and has been totally rewritten. Thanks to Surfy for that. And at this point in time, it will check out ZSH, Bash RC, what do you have, right? And it will read it if you have already something there. Like in my case, Ctrl T, I definitely like this one, which is a very small footprint. And the low cat is the coloring system. So every single time when I press Ctrl T, Ctrl T, it's gonna be a different color. And it always surprises you. That's fun, that's fun, really it is. So we're back and the utilities enabler here is back. And in the meantime, we have more stuff. We've added some more elements, check them out. Like the color scripts is new. That's um, control Alt T again for you. And we get this one next time we get something else because it's random, right? Every single time, another surprise and everything is fun. Now, all this information is in your bash RC. It depends what you are. We assume as a general rule that 90% of course is using the Arclix Suite tool on Arco Linux. We have our default files and folders and places and system in place. It's an, um, well, it's our system, right? In our bash RC, in our ZSH RC, you choose which shell you want and let's get that away sorry and here we have the r bash rc and our zsh rc so depending where you are what you have i have in this case zsh so echo echo the shell right so it's an environment variable i am on zsh at this particular moment in time so, not my bash RC, but my ZSH RC will be changed. So the ATT knows what you're doing, what you're wrong. So when I do color scripts off, it's gonna say color scripts off. And maybe we should just do it like this and click 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 again, right? So some coloring and lolcat will come behind it. So that's how we make this nice. Now, this is a lot of stuff that I've asked, so it's gonna give you a lot of stuff, simple as that. So it is entirely up to the user how many information he wants to see on his screen, but this is, this is of course, obviously for many of us too much, right? So choose what you wanna see, and then voila, everything is set, everything is changed, with just the UFetch Arco logo at this point in time with every single time a new surprise a new coloring system that's lolcat for you enjoy the new uh, tweak tool here right the terminal fun it's basically it's it's difficult right it's so difficult to program actually get rid of this hashtag or add a lolcat behind it if we our minds are like computers but if you have to tell everything to a system that should do it, that's another, uh, well, work challenge. Anyway, have fun. Terminal fun is back. And so now you can try it out. Cheers.